Hey guys, it's Audra Ratty Girl, and welcome to my lipstick declutter, my continuation of the declutter for my move. <laughs> Alright guys, so Bo is going to be here helping us with the lipstick declutter, which is a lot, so we, this might be in two parts. So <laughs> Bo Bear. So in this one I have, I've just really kept this Jeffree Star liquid lip because it was fantastic and I think it was just like out of sentimentality, but it's, it's old and it's a mask kiss, it's beautiful. But that is in my check it pile. It's too old and I've got to let it go. Now I'm afraid because Bo's sitting right here. So I'm just going to take this little one and I'm going to go ahead and start checking things in this. Uh, this is from Trust Fund Beauty. I really don't use this that much and I don't really like the color. The color was in Lipgasm. And I have other lip colors that are similar to this, and I think I can get ones that are similar to this, so I don't need it. So I'm gonna let it go. <laughs> He's got his toy. All right. Then I have this NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream. Um, I'll go ahead and keep this. It's a really pretty color. I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it right quick. It's really, really pretty, and it's still good, I think. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it is. It's still pretty good. So I'm going to go ahead and put that in here. I'm going to just put it to the side. <laughs> I'll put it up here. All right. So all of these ColourPop ones are hella old. So I'm going to throw them all away. Um, I have the Poppin' Matte and Mirror Mirror. They're all just like crazy old. You see how much like product I have left, but they're just like really, really old. And I just don't want my lips doing that angry thing that they do when you use an old lipstick which they just dry out and then you have like these weird lines and they're really pretty colors but I just never reached for them as much as I thought I would so those are going in that pile this is an old AF dose of colors and I'm just gonna let that go we're gonna leave that alone leave me alone okay so then I have this lip gloss by Luna and it's in Titania. This is actually gorgeous, and I'm going to go ahead and keep it. Um, it's still good, I believe. Let me just watch it right quick and see. It's got another month or so, so I'll like go ahead and keep it um, for now. <laughs> All right, and then this is another ColourPop lip gloss um this one you know what i'm gonna probably keep this over the luna so this one is in my jam it's metallic actually i'm gonna switch i'm gonna swap one's more pinkish and one's more bronzy but i like the bronzier one from ColourPop. so i'm gonna swap and i'm gonna let the luna go boom now this, I'm just going to, it's an LA Colors matte. I'm going to go ahead and just let it, let it die its death because it's old AF. A, it's way past the 24 months. Way past. Uh, this is another ColourPop lippy that is way past its time. It's I Heart This in matte. Uh, really pretty color, but it's, it's old. It's too old and it, it started getting those holes in it. So that lets me know it's D-E-D-D -E -D -D -D. All right. So then I have this really pretty ColourPop Ultra Satin Lip. And I love this one. I'm going to keep it because it's super pretty for this time frame. I just want to have like a kind of a natural look. I'm swatching the crap out of my hand. And I really hope the camera is getting all this. <laughs> all right. So I'm going to keep that. So far, I've only kept three out of this whole thing. Um, I love Tracy, and I'm keeping this. This is a red. It's Chile Red, and it's absolutely fabulous. Tracy is one of my favorite, favorite lip colors um, because I just love the way that it goes on. It glides on your lip, and it's just really pretty. So I'm just like, y'all speech. All right, so that's going in the keep. This, I just don't know where this came from 
to be honest. I have this L'Oreal color. I don't know where it came from, and I'm not, I just don't want to keep it. Obviously, I used it for something, but I don't, I don't, it's a mesmerizing Merlot, not my jam. All right, and then we have this NYX Butter. Um, here's the thing about this. So I like it, but it's, I think it's past, well, mm, I'm going to keep it because it's actually really pretty. I don't think it's past its date. I barely used it. But it's really pretty. It's this one right here. Keep track of what I'm doing. <laughs> so I'm going to keep that. Uh, this LA Splash. This is like an orangey color that I used to use um, on top of other colors. It's still like alive and kicking. And I think I'm going to go ahead and keep that. Because look how pretty that is. Faux shizzles. And the color is Sugar Rush. And I just really like this. Like, it's just, it's pretty, and I'm going to go ahead and keep that. I will move with that. I am not moving with this trash-ass color. Like, this is from Cargo Cosmetics. I love Cargo, but I hate this trashy color. It is ugly AF. It, if I want to look sick, then this is what I put on. Because even though it's kind of like a, almost like a bit of a clear gloss, when I put it on, it makes me look like I'm ill. So, I'm just going to say bye-bye. Um, this is an eye stick from Ico, and I'm going to just let that go because I have no idea how long I've had it. Like, it's not even a lip color, but I mean, it's a pretty metallic color, but it's not really for my skin. I've tried it before, but I just don't like how it turns out. So, bye-bye to you. This is, I believe, another ColourPop color, and this one is in London Fog. However, I feel like, oh, it's still doing really good though it's still doing really good though it's this red right here so I'm gonna keep it I'm gonna keep it <laughs> and finally we have this BH Cosmetics that is basically in Barbie pink I'm going to let that go and the main reason is because I don't Barbie pink I just don't every time I do it I look ridiculous while I have fabulous lips I don't look good in Barbie pink. All right, so let's do one more of these and then we'll be done for today and I'll do some other ones. Y'all, I'm gonna be decluttering for a while, so like every week you're gonna get a declutter video. I hope you enjoy this crap. Um, I actually just got this, so I'm gonna keep it. It's the ColourPop, it's a ColourPop clear gloss with some sparkle in it, so I just got it, I'm keeping it. Literally like a month ago, so I'm keeping that. Um, this is a Ciate Glitter Flip. I love this. I'm keeping this biatch. Uh, it's gorgeous. What's fantastic about this, and I'm sure you've seen the ads, but when you put it on and then you press your lips, when you press your lips, I'll do a video with this actually. Uh, let me know if you want me to, but I'm going to go to do it anyway. I think I did one, but I'll do a get ready with me and I'll include this. But when you press your lips together, glitter. I hope you're not just seeing a bunch of nostrils, because I don't have a monitor to tell if this is good. All right, um, again, my old ColourPop lippies. They're gorgeous, but like this is one of my this was my favorite one was this purple. But it's starting to get the holes, the aerated holes, which lets me know it's time for this to go. So bye, ColourPop. I'm losing all my ColourPop colors, but it's time. Uh, and then this one was also really, really pretty. But bye, girl. I loved you. We were good friends. That was weird. I'm sorry. Okay. Uh, this is the Ulta Butter Balm Gloss. I actually don't like this at all. I don't know why. I feel like it's because it was like a weird, it had a weird consistency. It was hard to apply. It was like this weird kind of clearish. It just wasn't, it didn't give me enough punch. So I'm going to let that go. This is the Too Faced Melted Mattes, and you know, the thing about these was like, they were like, okay, and it's great if I'm doing a very specific look, but I don't really do orange lip anymore, and I just need to just be like, it's good. This is in Mrs. Roper, and I know it's a liquefied matte and all that stuff, but I have to come to terms with the fact that... I'm just, maybe I'm just too, maybe I'm too old for orange. I don't know. Or maybe this just wasn't the right orange for me, but I'm just going to let it go. Uh, this is another Hikari. Uh, this is dead. It's 
I don't even know. There's a piece of fuzz on it, so obviously I just need to let that go. It was in Fireside. I just, these big ass crayons are friggin' awesome, but the problem is like there's so much. And lip colors are all like that, which is one of the reasons why you should really go through and declutter. I don't give mine away. I've talked about this before, but a big reason I don't give them away is because it's lips. There's certain things I do not ever give away. Um, anything having to do with the lips or the eyes. The eyeshadows I don't give away specifically because I have run into having a lot of sty problems. And I don't care if you try to use antibiotics or whatever you, antibiotics, antibacterials to get rid of it, whatever you do. I just would hate to pass that on to somebody and then they ended up with a sty and it was my fault. So I'd rather just like throw it away. And when it comes to lip stuff, I just, I don't, mm -mm, you know, unless you're family. Now this, I love this. This is Lip Lure from Pure and um it's in fancy now the only thing i really don't like is how it comes out in this like weird configuration but otherwise the color is pretty like let me just there's a lot because it comes out in that weird space but it's a really pretty color and so i'm trying to like minimize the amount of same colors i have but i really like this one so i'm going to keep it and we're almost down to the bottom i have this lord and berry color here it's a pencil uh, this one is in black red. I don't know why it's called. Uh, well, it's not really black red. It's more brown red. But that's what it is there. I'm going to go ahead and keep this because it's super pretty and I love to use these with my more mauve colors as the lip liner. So yeah. Um, this is from Locke. I'm going to go ahead and let this go. Um, one, I never tried to sharpen it. And two, like I just don't like that color. No. And also, it's like too liquidy at this point, which means it's dead. Like, that was real liquidy. Alright, so then I have the Tardiest Lip Paint. I love this particular one. This is in Vibin, and let me see if it's still Vibin. It is, so it can stay in the collection, because I was hoping it would. Alright, and... Then I have this beautiful ultra glossy lip from ColourPop. It is ultra glossy, no joke. And I love the color. It's on my knuckle here. I'm going to go ahead and keep that because I just got that recently. So that's good. And I'm going to keep it. And finally, obviously, I really don't like this. It's this NYX and lingerie. I went through this phase where I thought I would look good in brown. And it like, look, first of all, I don't like the applicator. And second, it just looks like Dookie. Oh my god. Bo just farted. It smells so horrible. Anyway, it looks like Dookie. So, this is the pile that I'm getting rid of. Compare that. Ouch, my feet. Ah, to what I'm keeping. So I'm keeping one, two, three, Four, five, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 11, 12, 13. Ooh, lucky! So out of everything that I've done so far in all of these swatches, I'm keeping 13 and all of this is saying goodbye. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it's helping you to declutter. I'm really feeling good about the way that I'm doing this. I'm really going to be super ashamed when I show you my closet, I, but it is what it is. But I feel like that it's really important for us to really start going through things because you have things that are expired that you don't realize are expired. You just, you just have so much stuff and you just kind of forget about it when you're not using it. And that's a big thing that I started doing is I'm like, I'm not even using this. I don't need to keep it. So I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, give this video a big thumbs up. If you would, subscribe or don't subscribe. Like, it's up to you. If you want to hang out with my crazy butt, then do so. If not, you know, hopefully I'll see you again and you'll decide to hang out next time. All right, guys, as always, thank you. I love each and every one of you. Have a wonderful day and deuces! <laughs>